Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Patricia and today's video is going to be on lashes. Not falsies per se, but on these lashes, your real lashes that are growing out of your skin. If you watch me for any length of time, you will know that I am a falsies wearer. I love my falsies. I've been wearing them consistently since the beginning of the year. And now I am on a break. I have been on a break since about, it's been about three or four weeks. It's been a long break. I'm missing my falsies, but while I am on break, I have been doing mascara. So I'm going to come in close so you can see my eyes. Here we are. Okay. So, if you are a lash wearer, you know that when you start wearing lashes consistently for a long time, it starts to take a toll on your real lashes. So my lashes are sparse. And they're kind of damaged, and that's why they're not looking all that great. But a girl's got to do what a girl's got to do, right? So I've been wearing mascara, and I'm going to show you which brand I have on right now. It is the Maybelline Last Sensational. There you go. Truth be told, it's not really doing anything for me. Let's zoom in again so you can see. Not really doing anything for me. I love Maybelline mascaras. I think they are the best over-the-counter mascaras you can get. It's just my personal opinion, but this one isn't really doing it for me. So please give me your thoughts, your opinions, the good, bad, and ugly on what you think. I also have three top-end mascaras that I've been using, and I'm going to show you what those are. The first one is the Tarte Tartiest. And this is the Tarte Lash Paint Mascara. This, it's a, it's a paint. It paints your lashes. It paints your lashes black. I mean, this stuff is like black, midnight black, blackity black, black, black. So if you want some super jet black mascara, this is it. But for me, it didn't really give me any curl. It didn't really give me any definition. It just painted my lashes black. And that was it. So give me your thoughts on this one. I also tried by Tarte their Lights Camera Lashes Mascara. Now this one I really like. This one gave me a good curl. It gave me definition. So I like this one. So give me your thoughts on that one. But I think the winner is Too Faced. Better Than Sex Mascara. With a name like Better Than Sex, you know it's got to be good. This one, if you take a look at the brush, take a look at that brush. That's a big brush, and it's got a lot of coating on it also. This gave me curl, it gave me definition, it gave me good color, this one I really like. So out of all of them, this I think is the winner for me. But I'm mainly doing this video because I miss my lashes. I need all my lash, lashinistas, whatever you want to call yourselves. Please um, comment below and let me know how you got over the hump. Are you still wearing your lashes every day? Have you just taken a break? How long has your break been? I'm missing my falsies and I want to go back to wearing them every day even though I know I don't need to wear them every day. I miss my falsies. So please comment below and let me know how did you get over the hump if you got over it or if you just took a break and just said you know what I'm going back or if you just take intermittent breaks or how you do it. Let me know if you like me better a la natural. Or with the falsies. You can look at some of my previous videos to see me with the falsies on. You can also go to my Instagram page, which is at PJ. Good God, I almost forgot what I was saying. It's at P Jackson, which is at P J A C K S O N E. And you can see me um, with both falsies and natural. 
and let me know give me your thoughts as always please rate comment and subscribe if you subscribe i will subscribe back just let me know that you subscribe other than that that's it i just want your thoughts your opinions and have a great night